evidence that I was there is on the real quality of the education. That the education now at the Ellisford School is really outstanding. And if you look at uh, the way children are taught today, uh, it is very different from when I was a child. That uh, the use of iPads uh, in the one-to-one, -one, uh, their technical competency at these things, uh, their community spirit, the uh, friendliness of the classroom. I mean, these are traits that we had at Alice Smith School uh, all those years ago, but I think the school has done such an excellent job in instilling values into our children um, and giving them such a sense of nurture. I remember very clearly the, uh, the headmaster of the school, uh, Mrs. Lee, and I remember very clearly my uh, first teacher at the school, Mrs. Ramage, who, who taught us from uh, primary one. It was a fantastic school to be at and uh, I've got very, very fond memories of my time there. I think being uh, brought up in Asia has been a terrific advantage to my career uh, because it gave me this perspective of the world and traveling out to Asia for all my holidays after I went back to school in Scotland uh, gave me that confidence which has really helped me in uh, later years. At the Ellis Smith School, uh, there is quite a high academic um, uh, ranking there. When I went to New Zealand, uh, I was 12 years old, and um, I found I had no difficulties making new friends. And simply, with all the sporting background that I had achieved at Ellis Smith, I found it very easy to integrate into a number of different clubs, including football, tennis, uh, cricket. And uh, also my academic achievements uh, just skyrocketed because I found I was about two years ahead of everyone else, especially in maths and science. This um, has come through into my life from my years at Alice Smith School. It's just a real love for travel, for meeting people, and I think perhaps to some extent that's why I'm a lawyer today. It's about listening to people, it's about forming opinions and not being biased but being open-minded and I think to some extent that comes back to my time at Alice Smith School. The thing I would like to say to today's students is study hard but have a thirst for knowledge. Set yourself challenging targets because if you stay true to yourself you'll be amazed at what you can achieve and I think along the way try and make the world a better place. Um, that's my message to the students.